see int a comma int b comma int c team here i have so much of my business logic is there i have so much of my business logic is there as of now int result is equal to int result is equal to a plus b plus c a plus b plus c here i am okay returning as a result team result now here see what is lambda expression lambda expressions is doesn't have any return type doesn't have any modifier team if your function doesn't have any okay, return type any modifier any function name i would say it is an anomalous class it is an anomalous okay function so okay, how can we do a comma b comma c simple team you are giving arrow arrow just you are returning here if you want to return something here system dot out dot print ln a plus b plus c in lambda what you will do system dot out dot print ln a plus b plus c so see how much code we are reducing team this much of code we are reducing using this lambda expression just to sing in line so if this it is a lambda expression i agreed it is a lambda expression i agreed if you have huge business logic you should write here braces but if this lambda expression does not have any function name how can i should call this in lambda expression if it does not have any function name how should i call this lambda expression see the answer is functional interfaces hey if you want to call me you should say sino sino sir if if okay, if i don't know name how can you call so if lambda expression does not having name i mean name means function name or method name method name then how to call lambda expression and who will call this lambda expression means answer is functional interfaces answer is functional interfaces functional interface is used to to call or invoke the lambda expressions a functional interface which contains only one abstract method that is functional interface which contains only one abstract method is called a functional interface that is called functional interface always will have always will have always will have abstract method functional interface is equal to single abstract methods abstract method is only one but a functional interface can have default methods and have static methods abstract method is only one but a functional interface can have default methods and static methods so now here a functional interface will have that is that is if a, a functional interface will, will have only one only only single abstract methods comma comma zero r zero r more zero or more default and static methods zero or more default and static methods static method so now you have okay i have written one small interface team it is a functional interface because only one abstract methods here i have declared two methods by default interface any method just if you give m1 default is public static void any by default all your interface methods are abstract methods even though you are not provided abstract here it will take by default abstract here but it is not a functional interface because more than one abstract method it is not a functional interface because more than one abstract method hey how can i know by seeing the definition you are telling that it is a functional interface it is not a functional interface okay how my java compiler knows how java compiler knows if your interface will have only one abstract method 
if your if your interface will have more than one abstract method how java compiler can recognize and it will throw an error when your functional interface we uh, will have more than an abstract method is with the help of with the help of at the rate of functional interface with the help of at the rate of functional interface so now here a interface may have abstract method interface may have default method interface may have static method team so if the interface if the developer is trying to add more than one abstract method then this okay, functional interface will throw an error hey developer so it is not allowed to more than one abstract method as you are declaring this interface as a functional interface that's why it is usually to indicate the okay, interface is the functional interface and an interface should have only an abstract method if developer will try to add zero or more abstract methods then it will give error like you know unexpected functional interface annotation here if you are giving zero means no abstract method found in demo interface if you are giving two means it will give same error it will give same error unexpected functional interface it will give so one or more okay one two see more than more than one abstract method is there it will give this kind of error one or more abstract method found in the demo interface okay so now here this is called you know basic overview about okay, functional interface we have some predefined interface is called runnable callable comparable action listener so these are all a interface will have you can okay i will show you the source code of runnable i will show you the source code of you know callable comparable action designer all these are only one method those methods are called run method call method compare to method action perform all these methods are you know you know all these interfaces are having only one abstract method that means all these interfaces are functional interfaces team okay okay understood right now we'll see now okay, next one so can you tell i have an okay interface a i have an okay, interface b my, my interface a will have only one functional interface now my interface will have only one abstract method here my interface b is okay, extending a then okay interface b is okay extending a then so okay interface b has zero abstract methods and never you will be accept, okay extending a means b uh, no no b b will have only b will have single abstract methods so b is called so b is called functional interfaces okay now if the okay, interface is okay extends functional interface and child interface does not contain any abstract methods then child interface also will have functional interfaces child interface also will have the okay, functional interface now another use case team another use case if the interface okay extend functional interface and child interface also contain any abstract methods then child interface is not a functional interface because child interface will have more than one abstract method abstract method team so that's why you see already you have a and already you have b okay m2 is there and you try to okay extends b interface with a here b is not in functional interface because now here you'll get compile time error now here more than one abstract method you know found here that's why your b is not a okay, functional interface team now third one 
third one if an interface okay, extends okay functional interface and child interface does not contain any abstract method then child interface also here b see here the use case also child interface also 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 contain same abstract method then then child interface is a child interface is a functional interface because this method will override override so this method will override with this method here b is an functional interface team here b is an functional interface team i would show you practically now all this stuff now a now last one a is an one functional interface now you are okay, extending b with a you have wired method now here your b is not representing any functional interface it is valid syntax wise is it is valid but you can't say it is an functional interface because whenever you will be okay, extend here you will get you know more than one method, okay, abstract method team here hope you are clear team okay everyone clear now i will show you start yeah, good i will start the practicals what is functional interface how to call lambda of expression now we are going to see okay practical steam okay examples on examples on first example is functional interfaces next example is how to call how to lambda lambda okay, expression using okay functional interfaces okay now PST. I want to use my IDE team file or, or if you want to show here I would go here just to for you can understand easily later I will come to a IDE okay, examples team new others maven project Maven project. I don't want a Spring project. Just to Maven project. Create simple project. JDK eight future city. Create a simple project. No, it is need. Sorry, Maven project. Create a simple project. Group ID, form dot cnotech, artifact ID, JDK eight future city. Version name you can give any name, but for standards, I am giving 1.0. Name JDK 8 features. This is JDK 8 features. This is JDK 8 features. I'll click on finish. Now next one, see, I am using here JDK 8, build path, configure build path, libraries, go to here, change your 1.5 to 1.8 JDK, not JRE, JDK, not JRE, JDK, not JRE. done team now even though here it is showing jre but right click on the project build path configure build path go to configure build path 
JDK edit whatever name will come here that name will be available here but if you see here here all are in JDK or not done team now okay, next one team see now I am creating a projects new class new interface the package is called com dot you know tech functional interfaces or i would call okay five functional interface examples now interface name is called something is called sample or you can give test it's not a or demo functional Or you can give a not a problem it is an functional interface team i am increasing my font size windows preferences font team please ask if you have any clarifications team you can ask you need any clarifications now here see i want to give public void m1 is it okay functional interface or not yes but oh, public void m2 is it a okay, functional interface team no how can we know so you have to declare a interface is called functional in you have to declare a interface is called it is available in java dot lang package see now it is giving error team see it is see okay, invalid function inter interface annotation a is not a functional interface annotation is not a functional interface see this okay eclipse design would be different okay eclipse your id would be different error but all eclipse ids will give compile time error all eclipse ids will give compile time error same code if you go here if you go here if you go for notepad and okay you will try it would give okay different error okay so it is giving as an compile time error so if i comment this it will give it will not give any compile time error say so functional interface will have only one abstract method here see if, you, if the developer is trying to add more than one abstract method this annotation will recognize hey i will allow for only one abstract method if you are trying to add either you should okay either you should keep only one abstract method if you are really your project is required more than one abstract method no declare me as a functional interface please stop me if you want if you want okay, okay utilize as a functional interface please follow strict rules a functional interface you will have only one abstract method here okay or if you want to follow your requirement your interface will have more than one abstract method no problem at the time please don't okay, include me depends upon the requirement you should use here most of the project in our real time every DAO interface and service interface everywhere you would tell hey i used in my project functional interfaces okay let's see now okay, okay next one team i have a one functional interface okay i have one functional interface a functional interface will have default methods it is a default method public void okay, m2 oh, it is giving error abstract method do not have any system dot out dot print ln method functional interface Uh, 
space we can put as a default yeah yeah sorry okay now it is it is a default routine Default methods allowed only at source level JDK 1.8. Yes, in my project, write your Eclipse. All are of important to team. Maybe it is not referring 1.8. You have to change your Java compiler. You have to change your Java compiler team. Now see here. It is a default void okay, to team. Default void okay, to team. So you can write a static methods also public static void m3 system dot out dot println it is m3 method. That's what the so that's it. A functional interface will have one abstract, one def one or more default. You can write how many default you can write, it's not a problem. How many you can default to write, okay, it's not a problem. Not at all a problem. How many static you can write, it's not a problem. But, but, abstract method is only one team. Abstract method is only one here. Okay, right. By mistake, if you are trying to call any one other abstract method, then it will give an error. It will give an error is, hey, it is invalid function interface. It is invalid function interface team. Okay. Now, now we will see. Now, till now, we are good now. Okay. Now, we will see. I am declaring the okay, interface is called B. Class B. I am declaring the okay, okay, interface is called class B. Not class. Sorry. It is an interface. I am trying to declaring again a okay, interface. New okay, interface okay, interface B team B. Now here see an interface. Now here I am okay extends okay okay extends A not implement okay extends A. And never you will be okay extends A. And never you will be okay extends A. Now what happened? It is a functional interface. Can I say? This is also a functional interface. Yes. No problem. I am using here case 1 option. Case 1. Already you have your interface. B doesn't have any abstract methods. No. B will have a single abstract method. B is also called functional interface. Now, if I called public void m2 it is my case 2 option it is my case 2 option b is not a here functional interface because already in a you have a functional interface if you are extending b means your b will have m1 also will be there plus okay, m2 will be there b will have two abstract methods b will have to abstract method as per definition of this functional interface it has only single abstract methods sam okay you can remember our famous hero in his occasion samantha like sam right okay like that okay you can okay, remember a functional interface will have only one abstract method team now here see it is case 2 we did here case 2 team case 2 also done team now case 3 let's assume that i have both i have a also okay, abstract method in b also same abstract method then what happened b method will be you know override o override with a method whatever the a method is there it will simply override by b interface abstract method then it is also called function interface understood team case 3 also is done now what is case 4 team 
case for I have M functional interface in B. I am trying to add M. Okay, M2. Okay, if you see, it is an, if I comment this, it is a valid interface. Interface may have N number of abstract methods. It is a valid interface. But it is not a functional interface because your B is not declared as a functional interface. If B is not declaring as a functional interface, it is a valid interface. But we should not call B as a functional interface because B will have more than one abstract methods team. Done. Okay, till now we are good. Okay, everyone is good. Okay, till now. Now here see. The next one team. What is our okay? Next one C. So I want to show you some of examples. It is non-FI. Non-FI means non-functional interface team. I want to take one simple I want to take one simple demo. New interface. Non-FI. Non-FI means non-functional interface. Simple interface is called a demo. This demo. My demo public wide M1 team. It is a functional interface. I would call it is a functional interface. How to write okay, implementations? New class. Class very very important. Please try to understand. Demo IMPL. Demo IMPL. Demo IMPL implements. Implements demo interface. Implements demo interface team. Add unimplemented methods. Add unimplemented methods. This time writing system dot out dot print ln m1 method m1 method okay system dot out dot print ln m1 method team hope you are clear team now next now next so hope everyone knows here hope everyone knows i am going to create a one test class i am going to create a one test class public static void main how to call this one team dot non functional interface okay how to do so obviously demo d is equal to new demo new demo impl now here d dot m1 d dot m1 t please try to understand okay d dot okay, m1 d dot m1 now i will run this application run as java application m1 method output is coming or not now so if you go for this is called without functional interface how your code is working now here i am writing same code using same code using non okay with functional interface how my code is working team same code team the demo is an okay, interface. See, you have to okay, edit. You, you have to more okay, habituate this functional interface team. Now here, see, public void M1. We know this. Now here, please try to understand. Please okay, try to okay, understand this. Will be very very important class. Test class. Public static void M1 team. Interesting one is here. Is it demo is an functional interface or not? Yes. It is a functional interface. So it is how to call demo D basis system dot out dot print ln. M1 method or Stenotech. That's it, team. Whenever you called this, D dot 
Yang one. Now here, see, please concentrate. Here, if it is non-functional okay, interface, you have to write interface, you have to write implementation class, th then you are calling to create the implementation class object. If it is a functional interface, if it is a functional interface, you are replacing your implementation class. You are replacing your implementation class. See here, you are replacing your implementation class with the lambda expression lambda expression your functional interface class i would say functional interfaces will remove the implementation class developer no need to write too much logic inside of the impl class everything whatever you are writing your implementation class logic you should write okay inside of your functional interfaces team that's it now here see you will get I will explain how this internally will happen, how the JVM will uh, can create this uh, okay, implementation class. I would explain. We'll go on basic steam. We'll go okay, step by step. As of now, now here see, it is our functional interface. So without lambda expression, with lambda expression, we are seeing. See here, with the functional interface, have you written anywhere your implementation class of demo? Have you written anywhere implementation class of your demo? No. You don't need okay, implementation class anywhere. But we, without functional interface, how the programming style? You have to declare the implementation class. You have to call this method. But with the functional interface, we can completely avoid the implementation classes. Replace your implementation classes with the lambda expression but you should know the this kind of a okay, syntax team either you should write in the braces happily no problem happily no problem one second so now here happy look it's not a problem team here because now here here the interesting thing is here see now here okay, interesting thing is here your functional interface now here your whole is okay replace with your lambda of expression team how to call the lambda of expression is very very important that's why we are keep on telling lambda 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 means you have to be strong on how to write this lambda okay expression is very very okay, important to team understood team now we'll see it is a okay, simple example okay okay next example now, okay, next example, I will go for here. Same, okay, demo only team. I don't want to okay, disturb this one. Demo only. I will write one new method team. Public, wide, wide. New method is called, let's assume that M1, M1 only. Or you can call it as M2 into A into B. It is a functional interface. Functional interface will have only one abstract method only. How my implementation class? I want to comment this one. Please, okay. If any confusion, please okay, let me know, team. Implementation class. How to write this okay, implementation class? How to write this okay, implementation class? How dot print and then the sum is. The sum is, the sum is, now here you should go here, A plus B, A plus B team, okay? Sum is here, A plus B. How to call this functional interface? See, okay, without a okay, functional interface, okay, M2 of A comma B team, sorry, 10 comma 20 team. So you are passing, okay, 10 comma 20 to whom? You are passing this IMPL class. IMPL class will be okay, execute your business logic. Here, huge business logic is there. It will be okay, execute huge business logic here. Now, if I run this, what happened, team? If I run this, what happened? You got an. If I run this, what happened, team? See, sum is means. If you are 
if the functional interface is, is not there you have to write so much of your business logic team use logic you should write here here is it a simple example you will see in future examples how how it is there now if you go for functional interface i don't want this i want this public void m2 into a comma into b comma into c whatever you want you can give how to write this in our lambda expression you have to know how to write this lambda of expression is very very important team how to write this lambda of expression please concentrate mod is equal braces if you have more than one argument is there this parenthesis is mandatory a comma b comma c you don't need to pass integers also why i will explain now system dot out dot to print ln this sum is a plus b plus c now you would call d dot m2 of n comma 20 comma remember what is the data type you should pass the data types or you should pass the values are integer only if you are not pass the values as your integer you will get a compile time error why you are it is okay referring your interface your interface what data and types are there you it is okay expecting same data and types here but your lambda expression your lambda expression based on this situation based on the complexity your lambda expression automatically will supply data type as an integer you don't need to pass explicitly it is an integer it is a string it is a float here see how beautiful this lambda lock expression steam this small hello world express hello world look examples okay you will not see beautiful you will see okay upcoming see if it is lambda lock expression so you don't need to pass any data type even though you will pass happy okay it won't give okay, any okay, error here even though you will pass happy B but why unnecessarily to write more code here so why unnecessarily you know length of the code here you can okay, reduce this data types also even though you will provide the data types or you will not provide the data types is not a problem at compiled time your java compiler will 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 provide this data types automatically to this parameters so here see now you will run run as java application sum is okay 16 even though you, okay, you will supply okay, okay it's not a problem okay it's not a problem here now here run as java application that's it you got it this team see i would say functional interface is used to to uh, you know to call the lambda expressions you know functional interfaces are used to to avoid to remove the implementation class whatever the implementation class you should be you know you write all the implementation class logic try to write all the implementation class logic inside of the functional interfaces then what happened you know our you know most of the okay number of classes would be you can reduce you know number of uh, lines of the code also would be reduced thing for you know everything you know if you see any way our functional interface and lambda expressions are beautiful team it understood now you will not creating any object so who will take care your jvm will take care at runtime your JVM will take care at runtime. JVM will create any one of the you know proxy okay, implementation class. This will be placed into some other method. 
JVM will take care at runtime. Who will execute this implementation? Compile time only it will verify the it is data types is valid or not. Who will execute this at runtime? At runtime, who will execute? JVM will execute. JVM will take care at runtime. It will create the our proxy class of this your functional interface. In that proxy class, all this code it will be placed. But understood, right? You will not do it. Developer will not do it. If okay, I will try to show how internally this functional interface also will create this implementation class at JVM level. I will try to show, but not now. First, you should understand the basics. Then we will we'll talk more. Now, next simple example team. Next example. It is also a okay, functional interface. I am writing one simple interface is called public int get length or whatever it is. Here you are passing string s. Yes. Good. Okay. Now, if you stop override, it won't have anything because the interface may have any other. Only here problem is add unimplemented. That's fine. Override. Here what happened? We should give some, uh, you know, write some business logic team. As of now, instead of business logic and all, s dot length done team. System dot out dot print ln. Given string is s. Okay, you will write like this. If you go for functional interface what you should do developer has the responsible what is this method name team d dot d dot get length of you would pass you take a team now see now if i run this what happened it will go there it will give awesome now how to avoid this if you go here functional interface you 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 have to know how to write your see you have to know there is no compile time errors also here there is no no compile time errors also here see how the beautiful here if you write any change if it is okay without um, functional interface you have to modify interface you have to modify impl all places errors here no need all the stuff you would see here demo d is equal d is equal i don't need to call anything s s dot length See how simple it is. D dot, D dot, okay, D dot. No, get length, get length. You are passing. So you know, take. That's it. If the in, okay, if the argument is only one, no need to pass this parenthesis also. No need to pass this parenthesis also. No need to pass okay, okay, written type also here. Everything will be taken care by whom functional interface you don't need to pass see if you want to pass string you okay you can pass it okay i will show you okay practically see you got the output yeah okay you are not writing okay sop here so if you write sop S dot length system dot out dot print ln okay system dot out dot print ln s dot length consequent okay and not written wide result okay I 
is dot length. It should give here one second. Whenever you called this lambda one, whenever you called this lambda one, how to write this okay, lambda expressions? D dot. Okay, here only we should write. What is the result we'll have here in integer? That's it, team. It returns output. Because here, here is okay, okay, something okay written right here. If you add okay, SOP means what? Okay, SOP okay, does not return okay, anything, right? That's why here we are getting issue. See how beautiful it is. I would say, I would say, no. Note is very, very important. Note. Functional interfaces will functional interfaces used to call lambda lambda expression used to call lambda expression i would say i would say strongly i would say lambda expressions is equal is equal removes the removes the implementation classes Removes the implement. Okay, that is that is reduce the number of lines. Okay, reduce the number of classes. That is okay, reduce the number of classes and number of lines in source code in source code team. So JVM will take care based on the lambda of expressions based on the lambda of expression expression jvm 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 will take care will take care write the write the write the implementation class of of the of the lambda expression okay implementation class of that lambda of expression and and jvm will look and okay jvm will okay, execute jvm will okay, execute that Okay, IMPL class, IMPL class at runtime, okay, runtime, okay, JVM will take care to write the implementation class of lambda expression, okay, instead of, okay, instead of, okay, developer, okay, instead of, okay, developer will, will write it, okay, instead of developer, we will write the IMPL class, he'll write the, okay, instead of, the developer will write the IMPL class team. Thank you, oh, team. Thank you. Okay, everyone. Yeah. Thank you all.